as the cavalcade of cars sweeps into the city hall in Cardiff and we think that the Prime Minister is down there. This is the Prime Minister arriving in Cardiff South East. He's just come from his hotel. The Prime Minister arriving here at Cardiff South East. He's just come from his hotel. He was meant to have come here an hour and a half ago, but he was held up allegedly because um, there was a puncture in his police car. He has said nothing to anyone. You can see he's going in and saying nothing now. I have to report, though, that the mood here in the Labour camp is of deep dejection. His agent just said to me, it's a great tragedy for Mr Callaghan because he can't come back. He's due to come up the stairs here, to come through, round this corridor. This is the Mayor's parlour where we were before and the Prime Minister is meant to come here. He was meant to have a celebratory drink with the Mayor, with the Lord Mayor, but of course the Prime Minister doesn't drink. The Lord Mayor himself was very dejected. They're hoping that he's coming up the corridor, up the corridor now. And this is this is an area which has a lot of statues of famous Welsh people, including Owen Glendower, David Lloyd George, Boa de Seer, who is looking down on us. St everyone's still waiting for the Prime Minister to come. They're, they're waiting in the count for him as well. I understand that it's been a higher turnout here, although we don't have any indication of what the result will be. The result is much higher. That The turnout here is 70 3.6%, which is co compared to 70.7%. We're still hoping that the Prime Minister is coming round this corridor, which is where he's due to come. Although this is a city hall with many corridors, most of them have been locked off, partly by the security people here. And it's conceivable that the Prime Minister may have chosen to come make a rather undignified entrance through a back passage, which would take him through the staff canteen and up the back passage, which would... We've learned that he's actually stopped just outside the assembly hall where he could go into the count, he could go straight into the count, but we understand that he's still waiting there to, and he may come round this corner, which is where he's still due to be coming at any moment. Well, Michael, he's we can actually see the, the Prime Minister coming in now. So he's changed all his plans instead of coming as he was going to, straight to his own committee room A, which was where he was going to watch the results in triumph. You can see there he's talking to the returning officer, the acting returning officer. The Prime Minister thought that the best way was to come straight into the count in order to avoid everyone who was waiting for him. So the special hotline that was installed in committee room A for him will now be unused. All the security branch people who were waiting for him, the sniffer dogs who went to check that the room was all right, all that has gone for a burden.